Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So a couple of days ago, I let you know that it seems that Windows Recall AR can be run on unsupported hardware. And this was according to the tech enthusiast Albacore over on X, who had managed to enable the feature on a device that is not a Copilot Plus PC. Because as um, we have been speaking about on the channel, according to Microsoft, Windows Recall is only officially available on Copilot Plus PCs. Now that video will be linked in the end screen if you'd like some more information. But just to let you know, and I didn't think it would take long, and already there is now a new tool that will let you use Windows Recall on so-called unsupported hardware, which has been developed by Albacore, who has posted this over on X. Now, first of all, just a side note, I don't normally post on third-party apps of this nature. But because we have been talking about this quite in depth on the channel, um, I thought you may be interested, especially if you are tech-savvy and have the technical know-how. But I'm not recommending this, and I don't recommend this, especially if you do not have the technical know-how. Now, if we head over to that uh, post over on X, Albacore has mentioned, I built an app that lets you set up recall without any need for manual registry edits or file patching. It's available over on GitHub. And if we head to GitHub, here we can see it's called Amperage Kit. And if we scroll down, it says Amperage is a console Windows app designed to help you enable recall on devices that aren't officially supported. Now, here's some important information. It says at the moment, Amperage can only enable recall if your machine has an ARM64 CPU. That is, any Qualcomm, Snapdragon, Microsoft SQ or Ampere chipset. So that's important. Without that, this will not work. Here's some other important inf information. Make sure that you're running Windows 11 version 24H2 build 26100.712 before continuing. Older builds, as well as newer betas, that's builds 26,200 to 26,217, do not include the necessary OS level components for recall. So that's important. And yeah, it says most 32-bit, 64-bit users will have to wait until Microsoft publishes AR components for their platform. So this is only going to work, as mentioned, if you have... Qualcomm Snapdragon, Microsoft SQ, or Ampere chipset with the necessary requirements regarding build 26,100.712. So yeah, you'll get all the information on how to get started. And if we head back to that post over on X, uh, you can also go check out um, an in-depth post over at Tom's Hardware, which I'll leave down below in the description with that uh, GitHub link where it will give you an in-depth overview of what we're talking about in this video. But there you go. Um, just wanted to put it out there that there is already a tool that can enable a Windows Recall AR on so-called unsupported hardware and just letting you know in case you would be interested. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.